you guys a year and after later are connecting with me to see how I am and do a testimonial. And I feel like these are very important because people like myself wanted that. We wanted to see real people with real results to feel at ease. Who is this woman and what are we talking about? This is Vanya Mankayo from Jacksonville, Florida, who we helped lose over 70 pounds. Want to know how? Keep watching. So my name is Vanya Mongayo. I am from Jacksonville, Florida. My weight when I did the surgery was 215, um, and now I'm currently at 143. Most people who are overweight, you know, we have the liver disease and that kept coming up constantly in my blood panel every annual visit. I'm very consistent on getting my wellness check done at the doctor's and it kept getting consistent. My AC1 level was right there as pre-diabetic, almost, you know, having to take the medication and I didn't want that and I wanted to change and I work, I'm very active at the gym, but I just wasn't losing the weight. I had to do the aspect of realizing what I was eating. It was a Google search. I looked it up online and tried a few. You guys were the most responsive. I remember last week, our, my transaction coordinator, she was amazing to follow up and everything. And she made me feel at ease of, as what I'm doing. It didn't come from word of mouth. They came with me re just looking it up and hitting, contacting a few of the industry that do the similar thing. And you guys were the ones that were the most responsive. So I applaud you guys for that. So Leslie provided me a checklist. Leslie provided was there to answer any and all my questions. After the procedure, there was also follow-up. So I loved that, enjoyed that. And Leslie was there. The, the biggest concern I had was coming from Florida to San Diego to then get into somebody's car to go to Mexico. And I think that's the nervousness of a lot of people. The Facebook page definitely answered those questions. So use the magnifying glass and go search it up because it's a repetitive question. It, Leslie said, hey, their name is this. And I, I don't know if she told me the vehicle, but she told me the name. So that gave me like a a sense of relief, like she knew the name of the person was amazing, this great person. I met a lot of people that I directly messaged and a few did reach back out and made me feel at ease. I think the best, the best consensus was, you know, I wish I would have done that sooner. And I am now part of that club that I wish I would have done that sooner. But I think it's the same. I mean, they were on point. They helped me from the beginning. At that time, it was COVID. So they, you know, they checked if I had my shots, everything at the front desk. They said hello. The process was super simple. Once you got to the center, I didn't have any questions. And that's we pretty much set me up as to what was going to happen. And again, if I needed any help, she was there to answer your question. You know, having a good support system after you've done it, that they understand that you are going to eat significantly less than it seems like you're eating little pebbles of food, but it's filling you up. It's okay. That protein is 100% your savior because you, you can't consume as much. So support system. Also, throughout the first three months, don't assume that you are going to eat that little. It's been over a year for me and I can eat more. So... This is a tool to help you. It's not a tool to forever keep you. It's now up to me to maintain. Throughout this year and so that I've had it post uh, pediatric surgery, my relationship with food completely changed. I realized how much I not only was a fast eater um, and not allowing my belly and my brain to speak and say I'm full, I realized how much I filled my plate. So completely different and and I feel available to be more active in my life. And that's helpful. I was active before. Like I mentioned, I went to the gym and everything. But now it seems, it seems like I'm a little light feather <laughs> at times. I suggest videotape yourself all the time. I realize looking at my past photos and stuff how different I look and you guys can search me up Bonnie Amongayo I doubt I'll be on there'll be another Bonnie Amongayo out there and it's public photos you'll see me at my 220 weight to now 143 weight and it's a shock 
a complete shock looking at myself. My best advice after this treatment is love each step. Know that it's not going to happen overnight, but you will see an end result so long you are committed to it. Um, they say the first few months you lose the most, and then you stall, and then you lose again. Trust that that's going to happen. Um, don't overread into it. If you, it's your body, it's your body, and you, you know how to treat it. It's your own temple. So trust the process. It's what I would advise. I mean, absolutely, I would give it a 10. I mean, you guys, a year and after later, are connecting with me to see how I am and do a testimonial. I mean, I feel like these are very important because people like myself wanted that. We wanted to see real people with real results to feel at ease. So the more that that's out there, I hope that people feel better by seeing me and, and hearing me. Confidence. MBS guiding you on your weight loss journey.